Hey guys, so today I'm here with a demo of iMovie for the iPad 2. Now, I thought about, you know, just go showing you guys a really simple overview, you know, show you how it works, but instead I'm going to do something a little bit different. So I just went outside and I filmed a bunch of clips with the rear-facing camera on the iPad 2. So what I'm going to do is edit them, render them, upload them, um, all live for you guys so you can see exactly how iMovie works, and then at the end of the video you can actually take a look at the final product. Uh, so let's just jump straight on in. So you'll see it's got a nice little interface here, and if we hit the plus button we get to open up a new project. Uh, so you can see here, here are our clips. Um, I'm going to be doing it in landscape. It does work in portrait as well, but again, I like it, I prefer it in landscape. So let's pick this um, and just drop this on the timeline. So you can see here, we can scroll through. It works really quite nicely. In fact, let me make sure, make sure the audio is on. Yeah. Um, so we can scroll all that kind of stuff really quite nicely. Um, over here in our clip bin, we can also take a look at pictures and the camera roll, which I don't really have anything particularly great. We also have audio. So for example, we have theme music. Uh, so, like let's say we want to add that, plays, that's okay, um, but uh, let's pick modern, and we can just kind of just experiment around with it and see. There are also our sound effects, so if we open up the sound effects, you see there are a wide variety of them. Uh, so let's take, for example, uh, the dinosaur growl. We definitely need a dinosaur growl, so if we play it. <laughs> So there's just lots of really fun things that you can do like that. And just like a thigh movie, it's just like on the iPhone, the iPod. You pick something up and you just drag it up and it goes away. Uh, so let's take a couple of clips here. Um, this clip looks pretty good. Let's stop it there. So what you do is we can just drag it down to right about uh, here. So that's going to be our clip. But we can also jump out to here. And there's a few different settings. So we can pick a theme. Uh, I think we'll do a theme. Let's see what looks nice. Uh, we'll go with simple. Uh, we can turn on some theme music because that kind of sounds good. Um, and we'll do fade in and out from black. So there we go. So let's just take a quick look at our uh, file real quick here. Mm, yeah, I don't really like that music. So let's, I'm going to go ahead and change it up a little bit and I'll be right back as soon as I'm done. Okay, so I've been editing a little bit. Let me just show you guys real quickly what we've got here and I'll explain how I did it. So this is just really simple. Basically all I've done, I've got two clips in here. Um, I've got myself a transition. I just picked out the music, uh, muted the clip. So it's pretty simple. Um, as you can see here, it works really quite nicely. Um, you know, the uh, rear facing camera, it is 720p, but outside it's not too bad. So I'm going to add a few other clips and transitions. In fact, I'll show you guys doing that. Um, so we just tap on this clip and drop it in. Uh, and then this is just a kind of a, a slow kind of pan. Uh, through some stuff, so we'll we'll cut it right there. And of course, you can just trim it, or if you want, just swipe it. Oh, something like that. And then if we want, we just get rid of this excess, toss it away. Um, and you'll see that iMovie in general is really nice, very very intuitive. So you can just you know just do whatever you want. Um, it works really quite nicely. One. Okay, so I'm all done. Uh, so I ended up not doing anything too particularly amazing. You guys can see here. Uh, just uh, just added the simple uh, sound effect, or rather the mu the theme music, used a couple of transitions, all that sort of thing. Okay, so now let's go ahead and finish the video up. So we're all edited, we're all good to go. And now we have a variety of options to where we can export it. So we can do camera roll, which is probably what you're going to want to do. However, if you want to upload it to YouTube, Facebook, Vimeo, CNN, or uh, send it to iTunes, you can all do all of that. However, I'm just going to be uploading it to YouTube right now. Uh, so. This is going to be pretty simple, I'm not going to skip all of this stuff, but let me just fill in all the stuff and you guys will be able to see the export. Okay, so I filled in all the information, all that kind of stuff, and now the video is all rendered and now it's uploading to YouTube. So there you go guys, that is iMovie on the iPad 2. Um, if you're interested to see how this video turned out, of course it's not an amazing, but I spent a couple of minutes on it, show you guys exactly kind of how it works. You guys can take a look, I will have an annotation on the screen right now.